All right, it's time. <laughs> Judy is back with the official Bully Worm forecast. Yes. Okay, we need to break down the percentages, though. Right, we exactly. We kind of mentioned that earlier with what the different colors mean, so yeah. well, we, let's this, hear it. Even though the Bully Worm report does not have meteorological credence or veracity, 80% of the time, they're right on target, generally speaking. 20%, they're wrong. So you may decide which one you like after I give the percentages. Okay. Okay. So this year, um, from the abundance of worms that we got from everywhere, 75% were black and very dark brown. 15% were in the milder orange multicolored light brown. And 15% were white, yellow, or gray. That's a pretty good shot at uh, what precipitation is going to be like. So. After much worm study, <laughs> <laughs> the will of the woolly worm tells you this. The 2022-2023 winter forecast, according to the worm, it's going to be a hot chocolate, cozy fireplace, warm socks kind of winter. In other words, downright cold. Oh, no. <laughs> and you might get out your boots, your shovels, and your mittens because 15% of, of our woolly worms were the light colored and they they indicate uh, a pretty decent amount of snow and of course the persimmon seeds agree with that so it looks like it's going to be one of those cold snowy winters so well, there you go. cozy up all the time yeah. <laughs> get next to the fireplace and stay there <laughs> that's right so that's that's good that's the way it's going to be now you can believe it 80 percent or you can say well 20 percent is going to be wrong depends on what you want if you want snow and you want a winter you're in good shape if you don't well yeah. there's always that error <laughs> I think Grace and I agree that we are okay with snow on Christmas. Yes, and yes. Then, the holidays. And then like summer. And, yes. that's, and then like today, 60s yeah. would be Beautiful. Yes. wonderful. Perfect. I would love this it. kind of weather all year long. Yeah. Okay, 100%. I cannot, I cannot actually uh, tell the worms what to, <laughs> right? what to do or say. They, they uh, say it themselves. And this yeah. year, the majority of them were black well, and, and bushy really fat little guys. Yeah. The majority of our snow last year came, well, last season came in February. February. So. And the year before, it was the polar vortex, I believe. So February is not, uh, you know, doesn't warm your heart like Valentine's Day. No, <laughs> no. I can remember saying last year when we did the report, when we thought we were going to get snow, right. oh my goodness, the kids are going to be so excited to hear this woolly worm forecast. And then we did get snow days and they had to do remote learning. They oh, don't even no. get a snow day anymore. Total turn on snow oh, days. Oh, my children right. used to love yes. that. Yes, when you wake up and it's like, no school. Yeah, yes. no, Best thing ever, go, go play in the snow. Yep. Yes. Oh, oh my gosh. You can yeah. thank COVID for that, I guess. Yes, I, guess I think so. so. Learn new ways. Okay, well, a big thank you to all of your woolly work. Yeah. Oh, out yes. There. I'm, I'm so grateful every year and delighted that people want to share this with me because um, I think they are delighted too. And if I'm recognized um, because of the woolly worm or associated with it, that's okay with me. And yeah. who knows how it. many um, future, you know, forecasters that we're developing through just this little yeah. bit of their research, collecting those woolly right. worms and checking Chrom out what they see. Chromatologist. There you go. Exactly. I there couldn't you remember go. the word. I love the way you it. say it, Heather. It just rips <laughs> off your tongue. But don't ask me to say woolly worm report. Then I'm going to struggle. So, okay. Well, thank you so much. Yes, okay. I know so many people have been anxiously awaiting your appearance here on Sea Living to talk all things woolly worms. So, bust out that hot chocolate and um, those fuzzy socks. Yes. And um, get prepared now for that cold, cold winter.